functional neurosurgery as the name implies uh, where the surgery is performed to improve the functional status of the patient uh, patient for example what sharan does is uh, movement disorder surgery so their patients have uncontrolled movements of the hands and legs or they may not be able to perform uh, tasks which they took for granted like you would have seen in his videos a musician is not able to play his guitar handwriting is not possible signing checks is not possible things like that even simple things like drinking from a glass of water or a bottle of water may become a herculean task so to improve these functions uh, surgery is performed and that is one aspect of functional neurosurgery the second aspect of functional neurosurgery is epilepsy uncontrolled epilepsy is very dangerous as you can see they can have lot of injuries even death from epilepsy children will have learning disabilities women may face uh, divorce because of uh, their epilepsy men may find the uh, employment very difficult so all of these issues can happen to anyone who has uh, chronic epilepsy so if we are able to ameliorate that with medicines it's very good but a proportion of patients will require surgery to control their epilepsy such uh, patients again undergo functional neurosurgery it is done to improve their function similarly for some psychiatric illness like depression or obsessive compulsive uh, disorders again uh, surgery can be done to cure depression which is resistant to medication these patients may be prone for suicides and all that so removing depression controlling or curing depression is very important for them Thank you.